Hey Taurus. Okay, so it's the mini read Tuesday. <laughs> and I just did um the mini reads for um Taurus and Aries, Taurus and Libra, Taurus and Gemini. Okay, so if you want to watch those, you can. Okay. Um, so now I'm getting ready to do Taurus with Cancer, Taurus with Scorpio, Taurus with Aquarius, okay? Um, so we're gonna do this for a couple Tuesdays just to see how it goes, and you know, we'll just, you know. So you all rock with me like I be rocking with you all, okay? <laughs> so Taurus with Cancer, and keep in mind it's not gonna resonate with all, okay? It will not, okay? You go always watch other channels, love the readers, the message that they bring, maybe what you're looking for. So this is for Taurus and Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Let's get this ball rolling. Taurus and Cancer. Taurus and Cancer. Okay, there we go. Thank you, thank you. The Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups. Okay, someone, okay, for Taurus and um, Cancer now. Cancer, this is your energy, okay? So, um, is you or either Taurus going to bring in um, an offer or whatever? Want to take someone out or could be emotional about something? Are you emotionally available? Okay, let's see. Yep. Okay, the Five of Cups. The Five of Cups. Yeah, like I said, um, okay, you, Cancer, you're emotional. What's going on? Why is Cancer emotional? This is for Cancer and Taurus. What's, why is the Five of Cups here? Yeah, look, we want to offer, okay? Let's see. Why is the Five of Cups here? Okay, what I'm seeing, okay, the Ten of Pentacles is in reverse, the Ace of Wands, as well as the Ten of Wands in reverse. Things done got heavy, and it's, it's you, you could be emotional. Cancer, either you, you're, I mean, you out here heavy, or Taurus, okay? Now, it's some money done been lost, um, and someone just don't want a new beginning here, and, and, Towards you heard about it, or either this council heard about this. Somebody, someone wanted to begin it, and um, this other person don't. They feel like the load was too heavy. They feel like the load was too heavy. Let me see. Clarify the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, the Ace of Wands, as well as the Ten of Wands. Yeah, see the Three of Pentacles. Yeah, want to work on it. Want to work on it, but one of you don't. And you, towards the council, it's emotional, but I want to say it's cancer. Cancer with this water here. The King of Wands. Ready to take that? She wanna offer up. They could be, you know, begging, like pleading, like, you know, trying to plead with them or whatever, however. Um, yeah, this 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 person, yeah. They the King of Wands, clarify the King of Wands. Clarify the King of Wands. Look it up. The, what what I say all day and all night. You see it, the two of cups. This person want to, yeah, this person is um, crying out. This person is crying out, okay? Um, Taurus, Cancer, it's either, it's one of you all crying out. You want, you you know what I'm saying? You, you really want to work on it, but the other person feel like it's, it's, it's too much. The lovers. The world. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Taurus. Or oh, by Taurus or Cancer. Um. You mean the world to this person. You mean the world to this person. I mean, it's a completion here. This person really love you, okay? Um, and they're ready to take action, do whatever. You know, um, I'm hearing, you know, bend a knee, I have a, but one of you feel like it's, it's a burden and it's just too much. You feel like it's a burden and it's just too much, okay? So let me give um, you some angel answers. And then I'm going to move on to Taurus and Scorpio. See, see, this one says not the right time. See that? Yeah. And then this one, perfect timing. So 
So the one who is all in their feelings feel like it's the perfect time, but it's not the right time because somebody feel like it's too much. It's, it's too much. It's, it's too much of a heavy note, okay? I'm sorry it turned out like that. Um, this, it landed on my thumb. Let go. Let go. Wow. Okay, so moving on to Taurus and uh, Scorpio. Taurus and Scorpio. Taurus and Scorpio. Taurus and Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus bring out true messages. The Taurus and Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Keep in mind, it's not going to resonate with all, okay? It's not going to resonate with all. I don't know what that is, but I'm going to keep it. It fell out. But you know what? That's the one. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry. It was the emperor that fell out. Okay, Taurus and Scorpio. Taurus and Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Taurus and Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. There's too many that came out. I'm going to put them back in. I just need to. Just two. These are many reads. Okay. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. Okay, one more. Oh, my goodness. Something is not going good. Taurus and Scorpio. Oh, goodness. And at the bottom, the Ten of Wands. The Ten of Wands. It's a burden. It's a burden. And the will of fortune is reversed. That's um bad. That's bad luck. The will don't spend the other way for this situation. Let's see why. The will of fortune in reverse. The will of fortune in reverse. Clarify the will of fortune in reverse. For Taurus and Scorpio. Okay, so it's a high priestess here. You could be a reader or something. Okay, so um you know exactly what's going on here. Let's see some clarify the high priestess for Taurus and Scorpio. The high priestess, Taurus and Scorpio. Okay, the Ten of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. Okay. Okay, so what's going on? Somebody going to a reader about this situation here, okay? Um, something that came up um, that's bad, but the Ten of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles is here. The Ten of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. So this reader could have told you that everything was good with you, with, with your relate, but something that something that came up, Taurus and Scorpio. Somebody that told somebody some wrong information. Okay, um, because the Ten of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. That's like you know happiness. Um, the family is doing good. Um, the Eight of Pentacles, someone works hard, um, in focus, but this reader done, it's either the reader told you something like something was, something was going to be bad or something like that, but it ended up where somebody want to really want, want this family with you. It's something, it's something like that, but it, the Ten of Wands here and then the Seven of Pentacles. 
Let's see. Okay, the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, this is like um, someone could just want to hold on to the money or something. Here, if I the um, Four of Pentacles. Look at that. See the will of fortune up right this time. Yeah, what done happened? Somebody done told you. I don't know either Taurus you went to read or either um Scorpio. And they could have told you something like, you know, I don't know that something wasn't gonna be right or something. It's either or either something was gonna be right or uh it was gonna be all good because somebody feeling burdened like it's a heavy load. The hermit, see? Yeah. It's either somebody that told you that everything was going to be good, okay, whatever, and, it's, and you're looking at it like, you know, things are still stressful and it's burdening you out or whatever, and you may get, be getting ready to go into hermit mode. That's Virgo energy. Let me see something. Um, Let me get this one flew out. There's something better. See that? It came out sideways. That, that's, some, that's exactly what done happened. Okay, this reader said, stated that, um, and keep in mind, it's not going to resonate with everyone, okay? Not with every Taurus and Scorpio, but um, this reader stated that it was going to be all, you know, good with you, you know, um, with you and your person or whatever, with the Ten of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. Um, but however, it's not going that way, and you're getting ready to go into her mode. Now, Taurus, it could be you or either Scorpio. And it said, it's, there's something better. And it came out sideways. So I'm going to move on forward. These are supposed to be many reads, okay? So I'm going to move on to Taurus and um, Aquarius. Taurus and Aquarius. And look at that. Get more information. <laughs> so this one is for Taurus and Aquarius. Taurus and Aquarius. Taurus and Aquarius. Hearts moving over already. Okay, the Emperor. Okay, this is for Taurus and Aquarius. Taurus. Look at that. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go ahead because they feel like for a reason. I'm going to go ahead and keep them. Now, the other ones, hey, don't be upset with me because I just only did two cards for you all, okay? But these flew out for a reason. So, we're going to see where this going. For Taurus and Aquarius. The Ten of Swords. Somebody betrayed somebody. Okay, Taurus and Aquarius. Let's let's see. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get this ball rolling. Okay, the Emperor. You saw I felt like earlier the Emperor. Okay. Let's see. Taurus, this could be you know your energy at the time. Um. Or somebody could be in, you know, the Aries energy. This person look mean and demanding. Let's see. Verify the emperor. The emperor. The emperor. Of course. Okay, yeah. So, communication. Okay, so you two could be like communicating, um, maybe trying to fix this, cause somebody betrayed betrayed someone, but someone wanna someone wanna um get this fixed with the eight of wands here. They could be sending you messages. Um, let's see, clarify the eight of. Clarify that. What's this? The star. Clarify the um the eight of wands. The eight of wands. 
Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so the Ace of Cups, uh-oh. The Ace of Cups came out sideways as well as the Seven of Wands. Okay, so somebody is like guarded, um, trying to protect themselves from this. Because like I stated, this person look real mean and controlling. Look, look how this person look. Okay, communication is coming over. But this, you, towards either you blocking it or either Aquarius is blocking this. And somebody is about to like, with the, if the Ace of Cups fall in reverse, that mean that, you know, you don't care anymore. The emotions aren't there. Your love isn't there, but it's sideways. So you could kind of still have love for this person. In the Nine of Pentacles. Someone want to be single with the Nine of Pentacles. Let's see. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah. Um, you still have love, but it's not strong as it used to be. And it's like you you blocking your energy. What what did I say? The Ten of Wands. You see it all day and all night. Okay? The Ten of Wands. Yep. You blocking your energy from this person. This person unburdened you. Okay? The load was too heavy, and they they done burdened you. But they want to work on it with the Eight of Pentacles. You see that hammer, okay? They want to work on it with the Eight of Pentacles. They, they don't want to give this up. But look, one of you feeling left out in the cold with the Five of Pentacles here. Clarify the Eight of Wands. Oh, goodness, I was in 10 to... See, the Knight of Pentacles, they want to work on it. They want to continue to offer. Um, but it's like somebody feels so burdened out. All in hermit mode. Why? Because you've been cut. Like the tennis, the, the, um, I'm sorry, the Knight of No, this person want to rush into your behind. <laughs> this person, excuse me, you all. But this person want to rush in. They want to rush in because why? They want this ten of cups with you, okay? Now listen, Taurus and Aquarius, what's going on, okay? <laughs> I'm so sorry, you all. I'm not laughing. I promise you I'm not laughing at the situation. I'm not. But this is the pinnacles here. You could have been given to, you know what I'm saying, Taurus. You could have been given to someone else or either Aquarius or whatever. But it's like now, it's like you, you still have love for this person, but it's not as strong as it used to be, okay? So let me get you um, an angel answer and then... Um, That'll be it. And then I'm going to do my regular Taurus videos. Okay. Within the next few weeks. This person may, I don't know, because if you're blocking this communication or whatever they make, look, look, wait, wait. This person wants you to wait. They want you to wait. Okay, see, and this situation will improve. Okay. Oh my goodness, somebody really want this or whatever. Well, I don't know. It all depends on what they took you through. But, uh, you know, like I said, they love you. You you, you, you still, you know, kind of love this person or whatever. But it's not as strong as it used to be like when y'all, you know what I'm saying, like um, first met. Okay? So, Taurus and Aquarius, this has been your general mini read. Okay? And you all already know I love you all. And y'all rock with me like I rock with you. Like, share, subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell. Tell a friend of a friend of my channel. I love you.